Hey guys, I'm Christy Code Red and this is Questions with Code Red where you write me your questions regarding fitness or nutrition or personal questions and I answer them candidly and honestly. So today's question comes in from Atlanta, Georgia, which I'm uh, very familiar with Atlanta, Georgia. And Lindsay says, Christy, how do you feel about protein shakes and protein bars? So this is a question um, that I get a lot. And protein, I, I don't view protein shakes and protein bars the same. Your body can break down a protein uh, powder easier than it can a protein bar. All right, there's a lot more ingredients in a bar. Uh, and I, I, on my program, I don't allow the, my clients to have a protein bar unless it's an absolute emergency. I mean, if it's, a, if it's an emergency, it's better than the drive-through at McDonald's. All right, but it's still packed with uh, chemicals and it's still processed food. It's just the best of the crap food out there. So you really don't want to get into a habit of using protein bars as a crutch. You really want to train your body to eat real food and to not eat fake food. Protein powders, I, I feel a little bit the same way, except, um, like I said, they're a lot simpler to break down, and um, you can add a lot of things to them, coconut oil and avocado and unsweetened almond milk, uh, different ways to beef up your protein powder and really make a delicious, healthy shake. However, you can abuse this system also. You can have too many shakes shake after day after day after day just shake 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 and your body's going to end up rejecting after a while and you're going to stop reacting in a positive way to to the shakes and you're going to start reacting in a negative way because your body needs real food guys you can't get away with fake food all the time so you don't want to make a habit of eating either one of these on a uh, a super regular basis you really want i guess like anything moderation all right you really want to eat real food vegetables preferably that you grow yourself or from an organic farmer, um, good quality meat, things where you know where they came from. The simpler, the better. You don't want to get too, uh, too complicated with your protein and your, your bars and your shakes, okay? Thank you, Lindsay, for writing in from Atlanta. Oh, lots of memories from Atlanta. I got lots of memories. Follow me online at Christy Code Red or go to my website, ChristyCodeRed.com. You're going to find a lot of testimonials, uh, code Red Quick Tips, more questions with Christy, lots of stuff. So I'll see you there, and I'll see you next week for another question.